testing testing one two three what is going on youtube what is going on all the movie goers around the world welcome back to the channel we are doing the ride home podcast if this is your first time welcome to the channel the ride home podcast as i am driving home i am giving my first reaction review of the movie that i've seen and you guys can tell by the title today's movie is zombie land double tap part two and let's start off with if i recommend you should go see this in the theater i absolutely recommend you go and see this movie in the theater zombie land was a hilarious uh whimsical funny trolling type of movie that is a, a fun enjoyable ride on all facets i really enjoyed this one guys i i really had a fun time at the theater uh, watching the double tap of the zombie land so let's go ahead and break it down it's i mean it's it's zombie land if you guys saw the first one you guys exactly know what you're expecting it's a funny like Shaun of the dead over the top comical goofy film and that's exactly what it needs to be it's in a perfect era of just funny whimsical doesn't take itself too seriously kind of film and it was absolutely amazing on all regards. Woody Harrelson, fantastic job. And I don't know all the actors and actresses names, I'm sorry, but pretty much they had the four main cast members of the group, which was Woody Harrelson as Tallahassee. And then we also had Emma Stone and my guy, I don't remember the main, the nerdy young guy who's the main character. And then the young girl as well, uh, Little Rock. And all four of them did a good job. Um, Little Rock was kind of weird because she's like older now. So it's kind of like that weird, like she did an okay job with her acting. But overall, everybody else did a phenomenal job they even brought in like uh bill murray was in there owen wilson was in there or i believe owen wilson i don't know that guy always makes me think of owen wilson um the guy who was the the resemblance of tallahassee but it's a fun movie man i'd say all the actors and the actresses they did a fantastic job this movie I definitely recommend hit the theaters, check it out. Is it a first day buy? I mean, it's definitely, it could be a definite buy if that's the kind of movie that you're into, you know, don't go into it, you know, really taking it serious at all because that's not, that's not what it is, you know what I mean? So, trying to beat this little red light here, bam. But yeah, guys, I mean... Yeah, what else can we say about this movie, man? I already told you guys I recommend for you guys to go check it out. Not only did it bring a lot of good content in it, I mean, it's just whimsical. Like, first off, they, they start off at the White House. They find the White House and they take over the White House. And you're kind of thinking, like, hey, it's uh, there's nobody that, that showed up to the White House at all. Like, the White House would be the first spot to hit in the zombie apocalypse. So I, I found that funny. Like, you're, you know, it's not supposed to be anything you're supposed to use common sense on. Um, the girl who played Madeline, she's like this, uh, you know, this 17-year-old blonde ditz who's just, you know, cheerleading, you know, sweet 17, kind of like just ridiculous, over-the-top, goofy, corny chick. She was absolutely hilarious. I thought she did a phenomenal job, the actress that played her. And man, I mean, from start to beginning, I mean, this was a complete film. It keeps you on the edge of your seat. It keeps you entertained. It's one of the funnier movies that I've seen all year. It's hilarious. But my goodness, I was very surprised. <coughs> Excuse me. I was very surprised how much I actually enjoyed this film. It was very entertaining from start to finish. Now, will it make my top 10 films of the year? It definitely can 
you know we're coming close here now it's getting to october it could definitely crack that top 10 you know what i would say right now you could put it in my top 10 top five though i really have to look into it and and, and really break down my top five to let you guys know but as of right now it's it it was that fun and enjoyable of a movie grab some friends you know grab a you know if you're at home you know maybe grab a pizza and invite some friends over or you know go to the theater you know hang out with some buddies it's funny it's enjoyable man i, I was very surprised by this one very surprised you know, pretty much the premises is they're just surviving. They're, you know, the old the old Walking Dead lore. They're just surviving in this world of zombies. And there was there was one kind of different thing. There is this new kind of zombie breed that's been growing, and it's like a more enhanced, faster version. It's a lot harder to kill. Takes a lot more shots. They made a big emphasis on this new zombie. It wasn't just a regular one. But either than that. It was just pretty much surviving. Oh, yeah, the other main premise of the story, too, was the girl, the little girl, Little Rock, she kind of skedaddled on the whole group, and she broke ways with the team, and their whole main story is they're trying to uh, find Little Rock because she, she ran off with this, with this uh, hippie guy. So everybody did well. Uh, really good movie, so had a fun time, ton of laughs. So yeah, guys. I mean, that's that's pretty much it. Um, they do leave it open ended, so you you know you are going to expect a Zombie Land three, probably a Zombie Land four. As long as this series keeps making money, they they ain't going to stop. You know what I'm saying? So they, they definitely leave they leave it open ended, and they have I mean they really have a fan they really have a fantastic cast for this man. Like it, they really have a. A fun cast, a well-rounded cast. They added a new member to the cast by the end of the film. And she's amazing, too. I don't know the actress's name, but she's, she's great. She was at the House of Elvis, and they picked... They pretty much found her there, and she's, like, pretty much a badass living by herself in the zombie apocalypse world. But, yeah, man, it's fantastic. I really like this one. So there you guys have it. My quick little reaction talk about Zombie Land. Post in the comments below. Are you going to see it if you already have seen it? Let me know what you thought about the film. Let me know what you thought was some of the funnier moments. And hey, new reaction videos, new videos on film, movies, TV, every single day. So I would appreciate it if you haven't al already, excuse me, hit the bell hit the sub subscribe to the channel uh daily content i hope you guys enjoy it take a look at all my other content and with that being said take care and be easy